Hey guys, it is me, Happy Star again. Welcome back to Last Night's Father. So I have some awesome news. New dog breeds are coming to the game, and to be exact, Rottweiler is coming to the game. So developers have kind of shown a small teaser. So let's go and let's check out that teaser together. Together, so I've already seen it a few times, but hey, let's check it out. So this is what it looks like. Apparently, we have here these diseased wolves, and yeah, there we go. We have these Rottweilers here. And, uh, yeah, if you want to watch this trailer, link is also going to be down in the description where you can check this trailer yourself. But there we go, something happened to Mama or Papa Rottweiler, and these disease wolfers are coming after that uh, baby doggo. And Drone saved this little pooch. The pooch is sad, obviously. But, hey, here comes us <laughs> to the rescue, right? And there we go. For those asking, right, what's when this update's coming out or what. I literally know nothing. I have no idea when this update's coming out. And uh, I don't know when we will be able to get these Rottweilers. Also, developers uh, had this message over here. So, in the cruel world uh, in the cruel world of the zombie apocalypse, there's still place for true friendship and loyalty. The fearless Rottweiler is willing, willing to fight for you until its last breath. Get your treats ready and free some space in the dog crate for the upcoming update. So, looks like that thing is going to appear in the next update. I'm excited to go and check it out. I have no idea when these Rottweilers are actually coming to the game, where we will be able to get them, or anything else that's all we know we just have this teaser and all i have to say is that i'm hoping that we'll be able to get this right whaler from everywhere maybe they have reworked the dog breeding system because as of right now it's kind of broken it i would say it's very outdated it's very stupid to get a true friend doggo you need to like breed like dozens upon dozens if not even hundreds of doggos just to get a true friend doggo maybe they'll increase the rates of how we get these doggos i don't know in any case We'll have to wait and see, but apparently that's going to be in the next update. Maybe we'll get some sort of an event. Maybe we'll like actually have to save those doggos, but I doubt it. I mean, it's just probably a teaser. In any case, ladies and gentlemen, we have some other awesome things to do. And hey, welcome to those that have just joined the stream. Glad to see all of you here. Welcome, welcome. But if you're watching this live stream after it's over, then head to the pinned comments down below. There you can find timestamps so you can navigate to your favorite parts of the live stream a bit quicker. Like us doing raids and us doing a bunch of other things. So... Speaking of raids, we are definitely going to do a raid today. Today and early stream yesterday's yes, stream. Today's stream is a little bit earlier. I don't know if it'll be two hour live stream as usual. Maybe it'll be a little bit shorter live stream as I have some things to do today. So that's why the live stream is a little bit shorter. And uh, yeah, let's get ready though. We have the transport hub to clear. So let's get ready for the transport hub, ladies and gentlemen. And hey, now I see this. Now I see in the chat those emotes popping up. Because now in the chat, you can like click a heart icon or something, and it keeps like going up. Now I can see those things. Before, I couldn't see them in the chat. Now I see them. So, welcome to those that have just joined to the stream. Thanks for smashing likes. Thanks for everything. Glad to see all of you here. It's like, read this if this isn't pre-recorded. What if I just read this and it was pre-recorded, hmm? What if that sentence that I just said here was pre-recorded? What if you are pre-recorded, hmm? Maybe the chat is fake, hmm? Everything's possible. Everything is possible. Um, what guns could I get with me? I don't want to use anything too crazy. Okay, I'm gonna get drop these Glocks here. Uh, what are scars? I mean, looks like we'll have to bring scars. Maybe we have like something worse. We either have Genesis weapons or like very OP weapons like VSSs that I want to save for some other events. Whatever, I'll get like these AKs. That'll be more than enough probably weapons i'll bring perhaps an extra i don't even know what a flare gun yeah whatever let's bring that flare gun let's bring some of these broken guns that's more weapons than i can that i need for the transport hub. whatever let's get that, those things and let's get ready ladies and gentlemen let's roll let's buckle up and let's roll that's way too many healing items. I'm over prepping and I know that and yet i'm still taking more and more and more items i mean a lot of these guns are broken so Okay, I'll try to break some of those weapons so that we get more space in the inventory. Plus, I want to leave this Glock at the base. I kind of don't want to use it. Yeah, yeah, there we go. That's a lot better. Let's go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. Please do Bunker Alpha. Make sure to check out my videos on Bunker Alpha. Make sure to check out the free-to-play playlist. Probably have like five, six hundred, eight hundred videos on Bunker Alpha. Maybe more. To be honest, so make sure to check that stuff out. It's like, isn't it too early today? It's never too early for a Happy Star's live stream. There's no such thing as being too early. Say so welcome to the stream to those that have just joined. 
And majority of the people actually tune into the stream after the live stream is over. Like I'd say only 40% of people check out the live stream while we are live. Maybe 30, 40% of people and usually the majority, the bigger half of the people usually check out the live stream after it's over because of the timestamps and because of the time zones, not the timestamps and everything. So there's that. I should have probably went to the expeditions thing to get the daily expedition loot, but whatever. It is what it is. Oh, I didn't get the drone. I didn't get the drone. No, 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 no. That's bad. I did not get the drone. Ladies and gentlemen, this is sad. It's never too early and it's never too late for Happy Sykes live stream, says Salbazer. I couldn't agree more. Thanks, man. I absolutely agree with that. Early live stream? Yes, it is early. It is a little bit early. Why so early, Sorry, I'm going to work now. I usually stream like three, four hours later from that. So, yeah. It's early, says DA. Welcome to the stream. Yes, guys, it is early. It is early. I have to go back. I came there and I have to go back to the base to get that drone because I've absolutely forgotten about it. Sayak, I am a dev for Last on Earth. I have the helicopter in Bunker, Charlie, and Zulu, says the Gaming King. Very nice, man. Very nice. Absolutely nice. Congratulations, I guess. I have a helicopter, too. I am a developer as well. Aren't we all developers? We're all developers deep down inside. Please read this. That's just a comment that says, please read this. I don't get it. <laughs> please read this. But this is just a comment that says, please read this. And Slog, thanks for becoming a member. Thanks for smashing the join button. Thanks for everything, Slog. Thanks for your support on the channel here. Thank you, thank you. Thanks for being here for a long time on the channel. Thank you, thank you. Kefir developer would never say he's a Kefir developer. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. I'm not a Kefir developer. Wink, wink, wink. I'm not a Kefir dev. Cyric, what do you, the content creator, have boomstick for drone? It's a drone weapon mod. What? Please elaborate. Hey, Cyric, I have completed the game. I even beaded crater, lol. Okay. New useless doggos coming soon, says Try For All. I kind of agree with that. Like, I didn't really explain my thoughts much about those doggos, but the current dogs that we have are kind of useless, so, I mean, I really don't care about more. Like, that's probably one of the, the things at the bottom that I add to the game. But maybe doggos generate a lot of revenue, right? People buy a lot of doggos, so maybe that's why we're getting new doggos to the game. I have no idea, honestly. In any case, hopefully the update's a banger, that's what I can say. And at least we've gotten a teaser, right? At least a teaser. For me, a new doggo, it lies in the same spot as a new backpack skin, right? A new doggo teaser is the same thing as developers teasing a new backpack skin. It's kind of the same thing. For me, super early stream today. Yes, today's live stream is a little bit earlier. Usually I start the live stream like three, four hours later from now, but it do be like that. It do be like that. Doggos are pretty useless, but they're also pretty darn cute. Yeah, absolutely. There's just a few pixels. We have like 50 of them in the base. But yeah, they're very cute, ladies and gentlemen. Absolutely cute. I cried with the doggo teaser. Anyone else? Uh, I cried as well. Couldn't fall asleep yesterday. Like, for real, for real. Yo, what's up, C? Why so early today? Welcome to the stream. Because why not? <laughs> why not? Being earlier. Have places to be today. Have things to do. So, that's why the live stream is a little bit earlier. Oh, it gets spat on. Oh, no, I avoided it. That's good. That is good. So, yeah, the last stream is a little bit earlier because it is a little bit earlier. Kinda. Okay, another zombie's gonna attack us. Actually, two zombies are gonna attack us. Whatever. Whatever. 
Nice spread shot. Rare colored huskies are cute. Absolutely cute. Totally. Totally cute. A Lazarus player has a life instead of grinding all day. Unheard of, says okay. <laughs> what a nice name. Okay. Uh, yeah. I don't have a life. I'm just kidding, guys. I got nothing to do. I apologize. Hopefully, guys, you accept my apology. Okay, let's now pop this drone in our extra pocket. And let's get this thing. Say, so, guys, what is your opinion? I actually want to make a poll here. Uh, are you excited for the new dogs? Yes, no. That's it. Very simple. Yes and no. Are you excited or are you not excited? That's it. Very simple. New puppy is Goop. This is Ram and Samuel. Okay. Understandable. I said, I'll be honest. I'm not really excited about it. Like, seriously, that's at the last, at the bottom of excitement. Like, if they announced a new backpack, I'd probably have the same amount of excitement, right? Like, that's how not excited I am about the new doggos. Wow. And the game heard me. The game heard me. Developers heard me. And I died. That's why we died, ladies and gentlemen. That's why. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Whatever, let's go back to the... To that transport hub. Let's go back to it, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. Is it worth grinding for the forklift? Eh, probably the third crate is actually better than the forklift. So, I don't even know if I'd go for that forklift. To be completely honest with you. Like, it's nice. It's definitely a nice crate, but I don't think it's the best crate there. Like, sometimes it's good, sometimes it's bad, and you have to assemble that forklift. So maybe just don't bother about it. I just probably open up the third crate, and that's it. Probably that's the crate that I'll be opening up today. Yeah, so it's actually 50-50 almost, right? 48% of the people aren't excited for the doggos, and 50... Actually, now that it's a bit different. 54 to 54, uh, 55, okay, so it just keeps jumping. Basically, almost 50-50. Some people are excited about the new, the new doggos. Some people aren't excited about the new doggos. Wow, people actually like puppies, says Ram and Samuel. Yeah, I know. And that's the reason why we keep getting those things. I mean, puppies are very, like, probably, like, the worst pay-to-win thing in the game. And people still like it. So, I mean, developers definitely kind of know what they're doing. You know, at first, on the first glance, right, it might look like, hey, developers are killing the game. They don't know what they're doing, right? But on the other hand, you have people that actually like that. Right? On the other hand, you have people that actually want new doggos in the game, so it's like, all right. I mean, we already have corgis. How many of you even have those true friend doggos? You forgot the drone. Oh no. This is so stupid! This is so stupid! I'll die again. I'll go back to the top, I'll die again, and I'll get teleported to the base. This is so stupid! Ladies and gentlemen, I forgot my drone. For the second time today. And I can't be the only one that keeps forgetting it. Okay, Toxic Darter, go and do your thing. Kill me. Save me from this brutal world. Thanks. Say, so there's nothing wrong with it, right? You like doggos, you like doggos, it's fine. You want them. Like, uh, most of the people don't even have a true friend doggo. And we already have huskies and normal doggos. Like, it's not like you have two breeds of true friend doggos, right? Like, you already have... Uh, we have a husky here. Do you have a husky true friend doggo? And do you have a... This true friend doggo? No, you don't. Plus, we have corgis. Like, do you have three true friend doggos? No, you don't. They're adding a fourth one. Like, do we really need this? At the same time, again, I can't speak for we. As you can see in the chat, 60% of people actually are excited about the new doggos. So, there's that. Which, again, the poll might also maybe be kind of misleading. Just because it says excited, people say yes. It doesn't really mean that they would prefer doggos to anything else. Like, if it would maybe give them... Actually, I'm not so sure. Maybe if it would give players a choice, like, get a new location or a doggo. Maybe they choose a new location. So, I don't know. 
But still, I am kind of amazed to see that 60% of people are excited about the Rot Whalers coming to the game. And again, I forgot the John. <laughs> Don't have one, so the potential of a Rot Whaler one is cool. Uh, yeah, you'll only have to find like 30, 40 of them, 50 of them. Like, I have no how many of them you'll have. Which again, like, it's fine. If you want to get Douglas, you get Douglas. Excited about everything in Last and Earth, maybe. As I said, there's nothing wrong in with being excited, right? If you're excited for the new Douglas, you're excited for the new Douglas, right? There's nothing wrong with that. People need different things. Yo, Los Marangus, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome to those that have just joined. Glad to see you all over here. Let's skedaddle. And also, a lot of people want new doggos and whatever. Because majority of the people have already quit the game, so the people that are playing the game, they'll kind of like everything about Last Earth, because if you stayed with Last Earth till this point, like, there's almost nothing the developers can do wrong. So also, that's why developers, like, can release, like, whatever season, and people will still be like, oh, it's a nice season. So there's also that thing. But it, it is what it is. We're gonna go and clear the transport hub. And we're gonna wait for the Rot Whalers. I have no idea when they're coming out. I can probably give you like 99% guarantee that I don't think I'll get a true friend dog or Rot Whaler because there's no way I'll get one. Like I only have one true friend doggo and I got like incredibly lucky to get it. And that's it. I don't think I even have any other level four doggos. So getting a level four Rot Whaler and plus that Rot Whaler being a true friend doggo, I'm, I'm never gonna get it. So good luck to those that that will want to get it. Good luck, ladies and gentlemen. How to get richer in Bunker Alpha. I'm trying, but it doesn't work. Check out the free-to-play playlist. Link is down in the description there. Explain how to clear Bunker Alpha and other stuff. Finding the dog is the easy part. Getting male and female to breed up is the... Is the grinding part, says the A. Yes, indeed. Wait, do we have an event here? Oh, yeah, we have the supply event. One of the better events in the game. People actually like the supply event. I like the supply event as well. The supply event is kind of decent. Okay, nobody's here. Are you going to do more free-to-play? Absolutely. I'll be grinding for the right whaler in the free-to-play account. Psych, are you kidding? Are you being serious? Of course I'm serious. Am I not ever serious? Can somebody... Tell me that. And hey, welcome to those that have just joined the stream. Glad to see all over here. We all should be patient and wait for the update. I'm sure we will be happy, absolutely. Absolutely, ladies and gentlemen. I'm already happy. And the update is not even out yet. Oh my goodness, they keep switching! Okay, that worked. Let's avoid... Whoa, how did I get stuck? There's nothing there! And yet, I still got stuck. I got hit with this stupid shield. Well, there we go, we did it. Uh, let's get the drone parts. There's nothing else that I want to get there because we already have a lot of those fibers or whatever they're called. Let's get the riot zombie and uh, let's skedaddle. Let's skedaddle, ladies and gentlemen. Mm, this. Whoa. It's like we can't get a Dragunovna. No, you cannot get it. It is not in the game. 
you can't get it. Can you even see it in the crafting menu still? Or have they- No, it's still there! They haven't removed it. Well... Oh, it's been since day one and we've never had it in the game. Do I believe that Juggernaut is gonna come out? I think we have a higher chance of Juggernaut coming out instead of the the helicopter. But at the same time, I'm not excited about it. Like, we already have enough guns in the game. It's not like we need more. But if we get more, I want them to be good ones. We got the Uzi. Like, that was the last good weapon that we've gotten. Uzi was kind of decent, if you mod it. But every time we get a new weapon, and if it's not good, that means you get less of other weapons. For example, they introduced, like, Winchesters. They're garbage. Like, this should honestly be removed from the game, because whenever you get Winchesters, that means you could have gotten, like, a, a VSS. Maybe not a VSS, you could have gotten, like, a Glock, you could have gotten an M16, you could have gotten an AK, but instead of those weapons, you have gotten a Winchester. So if they add a new weapon to the game, and if it's not good, then it's not gonna be good. Is it? But... If it's a good weapon, I don't mind it. So if they ever add a Dragunov and it's a good weapon, then yeah, sure, why not? As long as it's a good weapon. Okay, let's go down there. I'll probably get some of these Genesis weapons. Let's get another Genesis weapon. Let's drop down. Let's open the door. That carrion, sp not carrion, but the toxic spitter spit is kind of ridiculous. You can't dodge it. If the dude spits, like, that spit will curve. Like, that spit will curve. It's kind of stupid. Whoa, whoa, whoa! The parasites! Almost ate me alive. Well, I got him. I got those parasites. My bullets ate those parasites alive. Does reloading fit the game? I mean, last on Earth is last on Earth. I don't think we should have reloading, but I mean, if they add reloading, they add reloading. I mean, it's such a thing that you don't know how it's gonna go, how they'll implement it. These guns don't already break kind of fast, like what? We will reload the gun like three times, three, four times, and then it breaks. Um, let's get this. Get that crate, idiot! I clicked the wrong button and yet I called my drone idiot. <gasps> it do be like that. Even if you go far away, he spits, then it definitely hits you. Yeah, it's still gonna hit you and you can go like sideways and everything and you'll, you'll see that thing curving. You'll see that spit curve and it'll still spit you in the face. Unbelievable. Early last on Earth, says Jonathan. We Welcome, mate, to the stream. Glad to see you here. So yeah, to those that have just joined, developers have announced that new Duggles are coming to the game, Rottweilers. And yeah, we'll have to see. Uh, who knows? Maybe. Like, I'm going to be excited about the Rottweilers if... If we can get them. Because wait, can we really get Huskies? Huskies are kind of rare to get, no? Like, you just most of the time get normal Duggles. Huskies are pretty rare to get. Corgis are almost non-existent. So if we can find Rottweilers, you know, maybe that's a bit better. If we can... To be honest, also what people not realize, if they add Rottweilers and you can find them, it'll be harder for you to get a doggo. The more dog breeds they add, the harder it is for you to get the true friend doggo. Like some people don't realize that as well, but uh, you'll have more doggo breeds. With different doggo breeds, you need to get like a male and female. So on top of when you find a doggo, you also have to find now a dog with the same breed. So... It's gonna be even more difficult for you now to get the true friend doggo than it's ever been. And majority of the players already don't even have their true friend doggo. So there's that. And uh, yeah, but maybe they, they'll rework the true friend doggo system. Maybe it'll be easier to get it. <laughs> Said no one ever. But yeah, we'll see. We'll see, ladies and gentlemen. At the end of the day, who cares about the true friend doggo? We all know that no one's gonna get it. What we care about is having the doggo in our dog pen. And that's it. And you know it. And I know it. We all know it. 
Um, do I really need the draw? No, I don't. Um, a flare gun? Whatever, let's use the shotgun and then the flare gun. Is there a way to get ATV transmission? Why do we need an ATV transmission? When we can get it, Rottweiler. God damn it. You get ATV transmissions by spinning caps. You can also get some of the ATV transmissions from the transport hub here. A rework of the dog was never, ever, ever gonna happen, says the A. I mean, we can only hope, right? Who knows, maybe they'll do something. But I doubt that they'll actually rework the doggos. As I said, the majority of the people like it, right? If 60% of people like something, then they like something. They like doggos. So, I don't think they'll rework anything. Another mouth to feed, says Sap Sap. Or just hear me out, just don't pick it up. You don't have to pick it up if you don't want to feed it. I will take it to the base, of course. If I find it, I'll bring it to the base. I will feed it occasionally. 299 for Vat Whaler exclusive treats. Whoa, I never even thought about it. Vat Whaler exclusive treats. <laughs> In any case, it's hard for me to talk bad about the Vat Whalers, right? It's hard for me to talk about the, the Duggos because, as you saw yourself, we've just made a poll here and 60% of the people voted positively about the Vat Whalers. So, yeah, wait, I actually want to do another poll. I'm just like kind of curious. Would you. Uh... There we go. You can vote, guys, in the poll. So, would you prefer Rot Whalers or a new location? I'm kind of curious. What would be the poll here? Because, as I said, that other poll is very... Kind of also, like, a bit misleading, right? Like, are you excited for the new doggos? Like, maybe. Like, they're okay. Like, I don't mind having new doggos added to the game. And yeah, like, right now I see 90% of people voting that they'd prefer a new location. So yeah, just, that, just what I thought. Just because 60% of you voted for those doggos that you're excited for them doesn't mean that you, like, can't sleep, right? Like, oh my god, Rod Whaler's coming to the game. It's just, hey, cool. Like, new things added to the game. Better than things being removed, but you'd still prefer something else. Those were my thoughts, and now I know. And that's good to know. It is what it is. I would prefer a new location as well. Still 10% of 8% of the people voted for the right whaler. But it is fine. And also, guys, I think I can only speak for myself, right? Like... Maybe there are people that can't fall asleep and they're like, Oh my god, right whaler is coming to the game. Maybe I am one of those people. Uh, let's get the Uzi, this, there we go. So yeah, I'm glad to see that 90% of you are voting for the new location. So the game still has hope. Ladies and gentlemen, the game has still hope. Okay, so actually it keeps falling. Now 11% of people voted for Rat Whalers. It's still like 80 to 20%. It's still like 80% is like way majority of the people, so it's better. Whatever. That's it. Oh no, there's the miner. No, 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 wait. That's not where we gotta go. I gotta lure the schmuck around. Stop it! Get some help. Titanium is so useless. Titanium is useless. And also, some people want tungsten being added to the game. Like, myself. For example, I don't care about tungsten. I want new things added to the game. And if those new things require tungsten then I don't mind it. Because they added titanium to the game, but it's useless. They might have not even added it. It would have been the same. Because there's nothing we can do with it. So if they add tungsten, I want to be able to do something with it. Oh, anti-rad. I mean, that was an anti-rad. It's pretty delicious. The stupid miner is so fast. Shut your mouth. Sleep, god damn it. What do I have to do to put you to sleep? Yeah. 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 
Okay, I got hit again. So tips and tricks for the miner. I think fighting him here is kind of decent. I like it. And uh, yeah, get bandages as it's easier to fight him with bandages. As that way you'll be able to keep your health at full and you won't waste any first aid kits. Tungsten equals helicopter. I mean, yeah, if tungsten comes out and we need the, it for the heli. Sure. Absolutely. Okay, let's heal up again. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, I got stunned! For the first time in years! Whoa, got stunned again! I'm gonna die here right now. Okay. I still survived. That's good. That's what matters, ladies and gentlemen. Good. Yes. Whoa! Lord. I'm gonna make a broad shotgun scare or something else. Flare guns might be fine as well on this dude. I assume. Wow, he just switched. He just turned around. I got stunned multiple times, yes indeed. Like, pay attention to your health. Don't worry, the health has to pay attention to me. It's fine. If I'll pay attention to my health, I won't be able to pay attention to the chat. And we can only have one thing. Okay, a flare gun. Whoa, I'm stuck! No, that's bad. No, that's bad, ladies and gentlemen. The flare gun is kind of goob, though. And I have only four bandages. That's not cool. I'll get the meds right now. Oh, no, 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 this is the wrong one. I want to get the first aid kits. Because I used up stack of bandages. And whatever, let's get this gun. Oops, wrong button. Sheesh, we did it. We have gotten a terminal card. Let's get it. And let's skedaddle. A miner has too much armor for AK, does four damage for hit. Actually, we shouldn't be using even an AK. I'm an idiot. We should be using an M16 because I think an M16 also does four damage as much as an AK. So it's not worth it. I think we are wasting AKs by fighting the miner there. So there's that. But yeah. The miner reminds me of the hello Mr. George meme. I have no idea about that meme, but I'll maybe say that I agree with you or I disagree with you, whatever makes you happy. Whatever's better. Oh my god, so I got 12 health. Everything's calculated. We'll get a guitar here. Amazing. Early today, yes. Yes, it is a little bit of an earlier live stream than usual. I mean, we did it. We cleared the transport hub. I didn't expect that it'll be so fast. But hey, we did it, ladies and gentlemen. We absolutely did it. We're waiting for new location. Devs sure have a new doggo happy now. What? We are waiting for new location. Devs sure have a new doggo happy now. Whoa, and then you're like, Psych, read my comment! How can I read them when they're like this? Explain somebody to me. We need another poll, ladies and gentlemen, here. Uh, which crate? Actually, I want to open up just the third crate. I don't think we need a poll here right now. Or we need a poll. Uh, which crate to open up? One, two, three, and four. There we go, guys. I want to open up the third crate. The fourth crate is kind of me. Uh, yeah, the third crate might actually be good enough. So I think we should open up the... The second crate was also... Well, whatever, guys. Whichever crate you vote, we'll open up. I kind of don't want to open up the fourth crate, though, because we've opened it up like three, four times in a row. So still, some people might vote for the fourth crate, but whichever, guys. Whatever. You do you. Vote. And we'll see. But you need it for Dragunov. You need what for Dragunov? You need tungsten ore. Every time they release a new ore, every time they release new things, you won't be able to craft those things. So you saying that you need tungsten, it doesn't mean that you will get the Dragunov rifle. It doesn't mean that you will get like whatever new workbenches that we don't have in the game, right? Uh, whatever workbenches we still don't have here. I don't even know, man. Kind of have almost everything. 
Well, yeah, just because they'll add tungsten or something else doesn't mean we will unlock some new recipes. Because when titanium was released, a lot of things were changed. Okay, so it looks like the third uh, crate won. 46% of you voted for the third crate. Thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you. Let's open up the third crate. And let's see what kind of goods we can get from the third crate. I've opened up the fourth crate many times, the third crate many times. We opened up all of the crates. So let's go. Let's see the repair bench. Yeah, we still don't have the repair station. And we have gotten three guns and an armor. And you guys are telling me the third crate is better than the fourth crate? The fourth crate was better. Hmm. I probably got unlucky with this crate, but the fourth crate is actually better than the third crate. And you guys voted for the third crate. Shame on you. But Saik, you won it! I won it. You had the full choice of voting for whatever you desire. And you... Still voted for the third crate, knowing that I'll get trash. Thank you, guys. Thank you. You don't have the drone upgrade bench. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I know that I don't have the drone upgrade bench. We're talking about other workbenches that require tungsten. So just because tungsten uh, comes out, right? Let's say tungsten is coming out tomorrow. It's like tungsten is coming out tomorrow. If tungsten ever comes out, doesn't mean that we'll get the repair bench right away. As I said, a lot of recipes were changed when titanium came out. Also, a lot of recipes were changed where uh, ash came out when Ash came out, so it doesn't mean that we will get new recipes right away. Oh, I can't equip this armor. I see. Okay, I'll send it to the better world, right? We've gotten gas masks. Why do we have that many gas masks? Sorry, Rick. Uh, actually, I use gas masks all the time. Nice. Literally said nobody ever. I think tungsten after this season. I mean, it's only been like, what, 41 seasons? So you think on season 42 we'll get tungsten? Okay. It's been only 40 seasons without tungsten. Why all, why all of a sudden that season 42? Why all of a sudden season 42 will have tungsten? Shame on us. We're so sorry we, vo we voted for the third crate, says Miguel. It's fine. It's fine, Miguel. I forgive you. I forgive all of you guys. Don't worry. Just because you voted for the third crate doesn't mean you meant me harm, right? It's fine. We got a Winchester after all. And that's something. I voted for the second crate. No, 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 no. You didn't vote for the second crate. You voted for the third crate. It's democracy here. There is no such thing. Oh, I chose something. No, no, you didn't choose anything. You chose the third crate. No matter if you voted for the first crate, for the fourth crate, all of you guys voted for the third crate, and I opened it up. I voted for the second. Didn't do you harm? No, 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 no. Still third crate. When I look in the chat, I see guys, all of you as voting for the third crate. That's it. That is it. The majority is the majority. Even if it was like 50-50% or like 49-51%, that means all of you voted for one thing anyways. Yes. Okay, let's drop the weapons. Uh, the brain is working a little bit, kinda. Maybe not at full capacity, but that... I mean, how can a brain walk... The brain can still work at full capacity even if you have one brain cell, right? It's not your fault that you have one brain cell. Like me, for example. I have only one brain cell, but the brain is still working on full capacity. The one brain cell is pumping. But it doesn't mean that it's not working at full capacity. We wanted the fourth grade, but the government wanted the third grade. What do you mean the government? You guys voted. You are the government. Your brain is overheated. Um. Okay. I guess so. Perhaps a little bit. Need Act 3 or Burbs more than Duggos. Or Burbs. Not Suburbs, just Burbs. Who calls them Burbs? It's the first time that I've heard somebody call Suburbs Burbs. Time to go to the burbs. Sounds nice. Burbs sounds, uh, sound awesome. Okay, we gotta deal with the witch. 
So let's put the wish to sleep. Get a new brain. I can't get a new brain. If I get a new brain, guys, there will be no last on Earth. There's no such thing as having a good brain and playing last on Earth. Last on Earth ate all of my brain cells. Like, each gun here has taken one brain cell. MGLs take three brain cells. Uh, I'm thinking again. The last brain cell is pumping. Oh, the witch. We're gonna go for the witch. Uh, excuse me. Where are the shotties? There we go. Let's get these shotties. Let's get some Uzis. And we are ready to roll. Is that enough? Bro. Bro. I guess that's enough. That's more than enough. If you guys need any tips and tricks, make sure to check out my free-to-play playlist. Uh, link is down in the description, or also make sure to check out the frequently asked question section. Uh, all that stuff is in the description as well. So those are all the tips and tricks that I need. That you guys need to know. It's like, do you know what TI? What is TI? What do you mean? What do I TI? What app do you play last internet on? I use Mimo Player. You can use whatever emulator. It doesn't really matter what emulator you get. They're all kind of the same. Just whatever, whichever one works better for you. It's like Suburbs was interdust. Uh, I can't do it anymore, guys. I can't keep reading. That one brain cell is that one brain cell is dividing into the half of the brain cell. It's like Suburbs was interdust. Oh, you mean introduced interdust? <laughs> it's like, it's like Suburbs was introduced before the ATV came out. Do you think a big update will come out? What is the I don't understand the question. Like, I mean, again, guys, I can translate the question that the suburbs were introduced before the ATV. Will we get a big update? I don't know. You guys are asking me questions as if I am a developer here. I forgot. I, I don't even know where I'm going. Oh, no, it's still updates in four hours. Whoa. Whoa, that's sad. To decipher that is impressive. You have more than one brain cell, says Straw. And I still have only one brain cell. Just that one brain cell is... Is very jacked up. It's juiced up. We can't go and deal with the witch. Um, can we do it, though? Can we do a raid today, ladies and gentlemen? I mean, I have no idea, even. We'll have to check it out. Well, in any case, we'll go to the farm. Uh, then we need raise three puppies. Well, maybe we can do a raid, ladies and gentlemen. Maybe we will be able to do a raid. Whatever, let's go to the farm location. Let's go for it. That one brain cell has already used up all of its RAM. Exactly. Miss your dismantle videos. There maybe will be more dismantle videos. I can't promise anything. It's like, is there anything you can promise? Yes. That's it, just ignores the question and keeps going. What can I promise you guys? There will be more videos. That's a nice promise in my opinion. That's a good promise. Uh, again, I'm stuck. I got this, that. I guess it's enough. I don't need anything else. It's all right. Feed doggos. Oh, yeah, we could give stack of food for the doggos. All right. Okay, everything is upgraded. I wanted to say updated. I'm just thinking about that update. Guys, today's a big day. Let's give them three stacks of uh, food, right? How to get strong in the crater. I want to know some tips. I don't have any tips. 
on how to get strong in the crater as I don't play in the crater. You're welcome. And you shouldn't either. Ah! To get strong in the crater, don't play in the crater. Okay, let's raise these goopers. Can we breed more? Imagine giving them three stacks of turkey and that lasts only like for what, 17 hours or something? Like, excuse me, mister. Yeah, I guess it's fine. There we go, let's just breed them and we can roll. Don't waste food on those common dogs. Save it for the doggo skins. Excuse me? Did you just name the right whaler a skin? You get C4 from the crate. Why not count for raiders? I don't understand the question. If you get it from the crate, it'll count for raiders. For the raiders. Uh, let's go to the Crooked Creek farm, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. They should have pit bull dogs. Yes. Absolutely. Gooper plus gooper equals gooper, says Straw Hadham. Yes. Gooper plus gooper is exactly another gooper. That's what happens. That's what we get. Sayak smelting lead is the definition of zero brain cells because you find in season dot passes. What? Where did I smelt a lead plate? What did I do? New right whaler should have a mini backpack. Yes, indeed. And it also should have like a dog, a, a gun mount to it. Hmm? So it would buy it and on top of that it would also shoot. And... Uh, you might be like, sorry, it gets tired. Okay, maybe it gets tired, right? Maybe. But you also maybe need to switch Glocks, or maybe it doesn't get tired. You just need to switch Glocks in it. And that's it. Like, Glock gets broken, you touch the doggo, you switch the Glock, and the doggo keeps shooting. That's what I would add, ladies and gentlemen. If I was the Kefir CEO, the last on Earth CEO. Chief officer or whatever, I would add guns on doggos. They'd be able to shoot and lasers and lasers, of course. And then you'll be able to assemble a chopper just for your doggo. Because why do you have a chopper and doggos don't? That's unfair. Is it? Forgetting your drone twice shows you have one brain cell. Absolutely. I love how I keep saying this entire live stream, guys, that I have one brain cell, I have one brain cell, and there's that one dude in the chat with, like, actually one brain cell. Psych, you have one brain cell! Okay. Alrighty, welcome to the club, I guess. Welcome to the one brain cell club. See, something happened, I healed, it didn't work. Sometimes you need to now tap twice. And the healing works weirdly. You don't heal fast enough. Psych, how are you okay? How am I okay? Guess I'm okay. Oh, uh, let's get the Glock here. Oh, wow. I didn't see the Savage Giant. I looked in the chat. They keep coming out! How, f how many more zombies are there? What do we need to do? Do we need to deal with the three bulls or... With the Savage Giants? I don't even know what we need to do. I'm just gonna destroy these bulls anyways. Why not do it? Forget all uh, that. You should be able to ride your Duggo like your chopper. Hmm. That's maybe not a bad idea. Riding your Duggos, huh? Wait, there is a huge Duggo breed. I don't know if you'd be able to ride them. I don't think it's good for their... Uh, for their back. 
for their spine, but I don't know, there are huge doggo breeds. They're like the size, like they're the size of bears. I've seen one like that. I was going to school, I remember. Back in my days, I used to go uphill twice, both ways. No, when I was going to school, I had to go through the forest. And uh, once there was a huge doggo. I don't know when, where it came from. But that doggo was massive. Like, I'm telling you, it was the size of a human. Like, it was like a mini bear. And uh, yeah, then it went all the way to the bus station. And then it was chasing that... I don't know how I got to the bus. I don't know, maybe my... I don't know how I got there. I got to the bus station, but basically then that doggo was chasing the bus for a while. And bus was going like, what, 50 kilometers an hour? And doggo was just running next to the bus. But I'm here, that means I'm alive. So that's cool. A lot of people like dogs, right? Most of my life, even like right now, I'm still like kind of scared of dogs. Does that make any sense? I don't think I ever spoke about it, but... I wouldn't say that I'm now very scared of dogs, but... For the majority of my life... I never really liked them that much. I never had a great experience with, uh, experience with doggos when I was a kid. Like, I was chased by those dogs so many times. And yeah. That happened when I was a kid many times. And yeah, I... They're not that fun. They're fine now, like, if you have your own doggo, they're cool, I guess. But, like, I never had a great experience with them growing up. They have traumatized me. I have PTSD <laughs> from those doggos. I live near the forest, right? So neighbors had dogs everywhere. And those doggos were always on the loose. So you'd like go in the forest and that's it, then dogs would start chasing you. And that's it. In any case, it do be like that. Just as long as you aren't chased by a diseased dog. Okay. At least I have a pet dog in the game right now. Yes, I am so excited about having a pet dog in the game. Because that's exactly the same thing. But yeah, as I said, I don't mind doggos right now. I think they're kind of cool. But as I said, for the most of the time growing up, I wasn't like, oh, wow, doggos, they're so cute. I was like, those killing machines. That's how I saw them. So you're a cat person. I'm not a cat person. I'm not a dog person. As I said, I don't mind doggos now. They're kind of cool. But yeah, that's my experience with the doggos. Also, I'm kind of maybe not very scared of horses, but also when I was a kid, I was chased by a horse. And a dog at the same time. That happened at the farm. Yeah. We went to see someone when I was maybe six or something. And uh, then doggos started chasing me. I was running, crying, and then a horse. So yeah. So that was my childhood, ladies and gentlemen. That was my childhood. If I remember any more childhood stories, I'll definitely let you know. <laughs> any animal sees Cyric immediately starts chasing him. I guess there are different type of uh, animals, I guess. I mean... In cities, usually dogs, again, obviously there are wild dogs in the cities as well, like w less behaved dogs, less well behaving dogs. You got the point. Usually in the village, people don't train them or anything, and they're mostly on the loose. So if you let them go, they'll just bark everywhere. Like each household in the village will have like three, four dogs. Three, four unattended dogs, and they're just going and running everywhere and barking. But I do be like that. It is what it is. Who let the dogs out? I don't know who let them out. 
They were never closed to begin with. So nobody let them out. They're free. Have you been chased by any birds? Oh, yeah, actually. No, guys, I wasn't chased by any birds. Sadly. By an eagle, guys. An eagle was chasing me. I barely dodged it. When I was three years old, an eagle chased me. It picked me up. But luckily, I was able to escape. When eagle brought me to the nest. To feed it to his eagle babies. I... I kind of crawled down from the tree. And I survived. It's totally true story, and I'm not lying about it. Absolutely true. Cool story. Absolutely. Guys, you know that there are like those kind of people that need to lie like about these kind of stories. So I'm one of those kind of people. So guys, and then on my way home, the horses attacked me, dogs attacked me. Wild snakes and everything. Are you into cat then, or any animal? I have two cats at home. I would keep a doggo. I'd honestly like to keep a doggo, but... Keeping a doggo is much more difficult than keeping a cat. Cat, for the most part, can't take care of himself. Dog needs a lot more attention, and... Uh, I'd like to keep a dog, but I know that I won't be able to spend enough time with it, so I'm not keeping a doggo. Plus, they live in an apartment, so having a doggo in an apartment isn't going to be the best either. But yeah, perhaps one day, when I get older, when I become a boomer, maybe I'll get a doggo. Because I want a doggo. Parents have snakes and monitor lizards. Lots of work. Scary in the middle of the night, I believe. I believe. Keep a rooster, Sayak. Why would I keep a rooster at home? Who keeps roosters at home? As a pet, pet rooster. What animals do you want to be added to the game? I'm not thinking about it. I, why would I want more animals added to the game? I can't even feed the current doggos that we have. And plus they're adding new Rottweilers. Why would I want more animals to feed them? I can't even feed myself in this game. Roosters equals free alarm. Yep. And we have gotten a heavy handle. Goop, basically. In other words, goop. Um. Yeah, hey, let's bring the stuff back to the base. We have gotten at least something. Roosters equals poop everywhere, I believe. You can't t teach them to poop in a litter box, I guess. I know, I never had a rooster. New location, the zoo. Exactly, they sh should they really add the zoo? Maybe. Your goal there is to free animals. You go there and you keep freeing them. The zoo resets every two days. Hmm. Maybe that would be epic. For every animal free, you get points. You kill zombies, you free animals. And, uh... I don't know. A zoo if you feel like fighting zombie elephants or lions. Sure. Yeah, fine. I mean, why not? Why not fight a zombie lion? They should add the school. Excuse me. 
Uh, okay, let's try to drop some of these things. Okay, that thing doesn't fit anymore. Boom. Oh my god, I'm making space for the rot whalers, okay? And you might be like, Cyric, you're lying. Read this. Read this. In the cruel world of the zombie apocalypse, there's still a place for true friendship and loyalty. The fearless Rottweiler is willing to fight for you until its last breath. Get your treats ready and free some space in the dog crate for the upcoming update. So I couldn't, guys, use that doggo. I had to delete it because developers told me here. You can see it says, get your treats ready and free some space in the dog crate. So developers literally basically told me to delete that doggo. That's why I did this. Do you understand that? Do you understand that? I'm still trying to find tigers in Minecraft. I don't think they have tigers in Minecraft. I think there are like tiny cats. Ocelots or whatever they're called. But I don't think there are tigers actually. Unless they have added tigers that I'm not sure of. If they've added tigers then that's buggers. Um, aluminium. Oh, we might actually build the level four wall in the settlement. Excuse me, ladies and gentlemen. That might actually be the case today. We might build that level four wall. Whatever, I'll drop the cabs. Don't fit. Cabs should stay here, though. Maybe like in Minecraft with mods. Yeah, sure, there are tigers. Like, absolutely. You can have dragons there. You can have everything. Um... The brain is working, guys, at full capacity, trying to sort out this stupid inventory. And it's not about, again, like, I'm tired. I'm tired of answering this, but it's not because the base is not sorted out. There's just lots of crates, and lots of things go in different crates. And you have to remember everything. Oh, we also need to go to the swamp location, perhaps, to get some more wood. We should do that one day. Maybe even today we'll go and get two stacks of wood at the swamp. Maybe we'll do it, maybe we won't. I don't know, I can't promise anything. Um, Iron plates. Try drink water for brain bar. Thanks. You didn't make N free to play since 84 years ago. Okay. That's not true. And there we go. One more gasoline canister goes there. Let's see what other tasks we have to do. Let's check it out. Uh, we need to do this task, whatever, we did it, boom. We also need to deal with one more bull, so we'll have to go back there and do it. Okay, let's deal with one more bull, ladies and gentlemen. Because apparently I haven't killed it yet. How many guns do you have? More than one, less than a million. If you need any other answers, let me know. Should I prioritize the boat first or the ATV? It's not like you'll be able to assemble the ATV anyways. It's like, you, like you're asking, should I become a billionaire or a millionaire? It's like, okay. That's literally, that. that's, that's almost literally what you're asking here. Kinda. Well, wow, such a precise answer. No, I mean, but guys, how would I answer this? I mean, focus on the boat. It's not like you can focus on the ATV anyways. Like, both of the things require different things to do. Like, you're asking, should I focus on mining stones or mining wood? I don't know, it depends. It's a very weird question. It'll take you a very long time to get the ATV. The boat is a lot faster to get. But just because you're getting the boat doesn't mean you can work on your ATV as well. Even if you focus on your ATV, your boat will be done first. That's a nice answer. Maybe I should just be answering it like that. 
when somebody asks a question, should they focus on their boat first or their ATV? I can just say that, hey. I mean, that's what I always said anyways. Your boat will be done first before the ATV, even if you put all of your efforts into ATV. ATV is pointless. Uh, also is the boat. So is the boat. Do you think it will be a full-scale dog update, improving the breeding process and making it fun? Or do you think it'll be just one dog breed? I think it'll be just one dog breed. If we had more things, they would probably tease more stuff in that teaser. So I think it'll be just basic doggo. Or maybe they'll like revamp the entire doggo system. I don't know. I don't know how they would do that. But maybe they'll do something about it. I don't know. At the same time, I don't even know if it would be a good idea to revamp that doggo system because there were people that have spent... But at the same time, games always evolve, right? Just because somebody spent like thousands of dollars on doggos to get those doggos and just because the next update developers made it easier to obtain those doggos doesn't mean that those people got scammed, right? It happens all the time in mobile games. Like, you grind for it, you spend money on it. And then the next update becomes easier, that's it. So yeah, maybe they will revamp the doggos one day. Because I wanted to say maybe it would be unfair towards those that have grinded, have spent lots of money to get the true friend doggo. Maybe that wouldn't be unfair. Maybe that would be unfair towards those people, but... I don't know, man. Okay, let's get ready. Go on skedaddle. I miss the airplane event. You get only the airplane event once, or actually two or three times. I don't know, once or thrice. That's it, that's what you get. And it happens only at the beginning of the game, and if you... ...didn't go there, then that's it. Get ready to rumble. Yes, we're getting ready to rumble, ladies and gentlemen. We're getting ready. We're getting ready to rumble. Um, the brain again is working, like that one brain cell is pumping, kinda. Oh, we need two glocks for the raid. So are you ready, buckaroos? Or so, as somebody said, are you ready to rumble? Ready to rumble. Bro. Okay, I don't have any more Glocks in the base. Excuse me, mister. But well, luckily I got two Glocks here. Uh, sorry, I just downloaded Last on Earth. Can you provide tips and tricks? Wait, let me get my crate with tips and tricks. There we go, I got my crate with tips and tricks. And there we go, there's a tip and trick. The entire book, take it. It's my free-to-play playlist. Link is down in the description. Make sure to check it out. Like, yeah, I share all the tips and tricks on how to play Last Day on Earth. There we go, I provided tips and tricks from the crate with tips and tricks. The free-to-play playlist. The free-to-play playlist. Link is down in the description. Uh, let's hop on the chopper. And let's go for the right number, uno of the day. Start your engines, yes indeed. What a comedian, thank you, thank you. I'm a clown. Maybe even, perhaps an entire circus. It's like airplane event spawns on low energy at the very beginning of the game. It doesn't spawn, it spawns on lower energy, but only at the beginning of the game. You get like first three events. You'll probably keep getting them unless you either reach a certain level, which I'm not sure about it, or until you do like those two or three events and that's it, and then they disappear. So there's that. Whoa! This will be an insane raid. You might be like, oh my God, sir, you're lying. Have I ever lied to you? Look me in the eyes. Have I ever lied to you? I don't think so. This will be an insane raid. 
And nani. That is, that's exactly. This raid is going to make you go nani. That's the raid. Who likes doggos? They only do five damage. Actually, you can improve them with the bloodhounds or something. And they can do 20 damage. 25 maybe max. So they can be decent. To be honest. Okay, let's open this door up, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. Nothing here. Nothing here as well, guys. The first ever raid that has no crates. <laughs> well, looks like there's something up there. Because I don't think raids exist with, exist with no crates, but that's kind of a troll, right? How many crates do we have here? Well, at least we have like four, five, six, seven crates. Not bad. Not that bad. Let's see what we can find here. Some planks. All right. I'll bite. What else can we get here? Ladies and gentlemen, a little bit of gasolinium. I'll take it. Almost cried. Don't cry. Or some people say if you cry, you will pee less. So, I mean, you do you. Uh, some ATV wheels. We could probably bring them back home and recycle them, but I'm not recycling those wheels. Oh, we have gotten some Glocks. Not that bad. Even though they're broken Glocks, I'd prefer them to be at full durability, but it's better than nothing. I'll take it. Plus some healing items. You know what? This raid just went from... From hero to... to wait, from zero to hero. Yeah. Red ticket. Somebody mentioned gasoline. Did it take it? Yeah, of course I took the gasoline already. It's like, bro, what do you think about the new Rottweiler dog? Amazing. Super excited to get it. Can't wait to get it. Okay, we can get those things to crowd bandage us. And I guess that is it. You missed berry tea. No, no, I left it for later. I left that berry tea for later. So that is it. That's the raid, ladies and gentlemen. Was it good? Yeah, it gets my approval. You know what? It's a very weird raid. But we have gotten a few guns. Like in total, let's say we can combine like two. Three guns. Maybe we got like three durability guns. Maybe a bit more. Like three durability guns, some other goops. So it's not that bad. So it's not bad, ladies and gentlemen. It's good. The raid is good. I prefer broken Glocks personally, says Joel. Full durability is overrated. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. That person's a menace. You're a threat to the society. Stop it. Did you leave the saw blade maze behind? We have like three racks of uh, melee weapons or something. I don't have space for... For the saw blade mace, sadly. I left it for later. To pick it up later. As they say, don't judge a book by its cover. Yes, indeed. And cover designers. Or a bit sad. Do we have any cover designers in the in the chat here right now? How do you feel when people say don't judge a book by its cover? Hmm? Everybody judges books by their cover. It's Joel's world we are living in. Fair enough. I apologize, Joel. I apologize, Joel. <laughs> what if we could modify our dogs, the dogs in a new update? Yeah, as I said, to add uh, darts to their head or something. Yeah, sure. Give them a tactical backpack, darts. Hell yeah. Excited. Hashtag excited. It's like, have you ever considered playing some different horror games, such as Five Nights at Freddy's or Slenderman? I think I've already answered a similar question last time. I don't know if it was you asking it or not, but... I have made a few Five Nights at Freddy's videos, the VR videos. I've never played Slenderman. I doubt I will. The game is probably older than me. And 
And uh, yeah, I guess that that's it. Maybe there will be more horror games someday in the future. Maybe we'll play something. I don't know. Let's drop the katana. Free fire ranked with viewers when, says insane. That's a good question. That is actually a good question. Free fire. <laughs> free fire. I used to probably play free fire on the channel. I think I had a few live streams on free fire. That is said. Uh, how's your settlement coming along? Water pump done? Nope, the water pump is not done yet. Water pump. More like water, don't! Ha 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 ha! That was a pretty goopy joke. Actually, it was a pretty good joke. I take my words back. One of the best jokes I've said. We are playing Laz and Earth here. Like, the bar is pretty low. You can't come up here with amazing jokes. Hundred and eighty red tickets. Wow, we also have some red tickets in Bunker Alpha, like over a hundred. So there's that. Best goofy laugh. What do you mean goofy laugh? Somebody left a comment quite recently. I'm probably not gonna find it right now, but maybe I'd find it if I sorted by goofy. But like basically, somebody left a comment, uh, a timestamp with the Scum Survival video where I laughed, and they said, "Haha, what a goofy laugh!" And I was like, "Bro, what? What do you mean goofy laugh? I don't have a goofy laugh, guys." I have a normal adult serious laugh. I don't have a goofy laugh. So please, stop it. Don't say that I got a goofy laugh. You're hurting my feelings. I never heard you laughing anyway. Exactly. There's nothing to laugh about. Life is a serious thing. What would you laugh? Why would you waste your life laughing when you can be serious and sad all the time? Hmm? Just think about it. Can I forgot what I'm doing? Ah, uh, the brain cell. Okay, I squeezed my head a little bit. Give CPR to my brain cell. And I think I know what I'm doing. I think I know it. Normal serious adult laugh. How boring. I don't even know what is the normal serious adult laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Stop it, guys. That's the normal serious adult laugh. <laughs> Why waste laughing when you can become a clown? Why waste laughing? What? Waste what? Watching from Japan, says Michael. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. You made me sad now. Good. Good. <laughs> what is going on? What is this? Watching from Philippines. Welcome mate to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Bro forgot to buy some brain cells. Actually, you can't buy brain cells. Let's get rid of this. It's like, do you still work at the settlement full time? Do you still work at the settlement? <laughs> I'm working at it right now. Um, let's drop it here. Here. That is it, guys. Let's finish the level four wall. I can't believe it. But we have actually... We've done it. We can do it. The wall, ladies and gentlemen. The wall. We did it. Is it. Does it look bigger? Does it look better? Looks nothing. Looks like nothing, in my humble opinion, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, let's see what's up then. Now we can... 
upgrade and do more things. Now we have seriously unlocked lots of new stuff. Except I want to get a daily loot. Can we get a level 4 wall or is this a level 3 wall? Is this a max level wall or not? Okay, so we can get a level 4 wall. Whoa! Whoa, mister! Uh, well, what buttons have I clicked here? So it's not a... Crazy wall. Not the wall. Well, we did upgrade the wall. So now, ladies and gentlemen, with this wall... We can... Upgrade these things. Like, for example, the lumber thing. We can... Upgrade it. We have the level 3 wall. Now we need to craft frame floors. We need to connect this grinder to the electricity and then we need to build this carpenter stable. Which is pretty much whatever. Wait, what about this thing? Have I upgraded anything here? Okay, so I need to connect the grindstone to electricity. Where's the grindstone? Have I even built it? Have I even built the grindstone, the grindstone thing? Okay, so we can build that stuff. I can put it, I can build it here. And then I'll have to connect it to electricity. And then I also need to have eight framed floors. Whoa. How to upgrade to those framed floors. Whoa! Whoa! Did you see the amount of things we need? We need those slates. Why would you need that? Oh, because we are probably also upgrading the roof at the same time. That's what the game probably wants you to think because there, there are also roofs here. So I think we are upgrading roofs with those. Uh, corrugated slates or whatever they're called. I don't know when we'll upgrade the settlement, ladies and gentlemen. Honestly. It'll take us a long, long time. Like, we could do it probably faster if the motivation was there, but... Am I motivated to upgrade the base? I don't know. Another month of grinding. I mean, again, like, why would I upgrade this thing? It's not like I'll get anything from it anyways. It's kind of... I know, the settlement is goop. It does not get my approval. It's kind of garbage. Honestly. Like, settlement is, like, garbage. I said it. Well, that is it. We got some more stripes. Now imagine a casual player, how much time will it will need? Actually, casual players can do this thing faster than me, probably. I mean, if I was playing daily, then yes. Because I could get like help from some developers and whatever, plus I'll play I'll play this game a lot, so we could build those things fast, but like it's just it's goop. Everything is goop. I agree with you. Couldn't even level up this dude to level 40. Still need more things. It's just, it's a lot of grind. Now I need to get those uh, square thingies, whatever they're called. We need a lot of these frames, right? We need a lot of those frames. Then I need parts. These parts. And then I need those slates. Those slates are stupid difficult to get from the molder. Like, we need iron wires. We need sawdust. Bruh. Or it's just constant grind. It's not that... I mean, it would be... I wouldn't mind it if there was a reason for it. If it was interesting and actually worth it. Like, honestly, I wouldn't mind it. I don't think it's that bad. There are light parts. We need to connect this thing to electricity as well. To get these light parts. Well, at least we get two light parts from one wood. So it's not that difficult. Too many items jumbled in one. Yeah. Yeah. Give me reasons why I should grind the settlement. Why would I give you reasons to grind the settlement? Like, explain to me. Give me reasons why I should give you reasons to grind the settlement. When I'm telling you that it's trash, I am literally sitting here telling you that settlement is trash. So I give me reasons why I should grind the settlement. Okay. All right. What do those slates look rusty already? Hey, they're just brown slates for the roof, I guess. They're like roof slates. They're not made out of metal. I think they're made out of asbestos. But, yeah. So, I don't know, man. I don't want to go to the settlement. I'm, I, I get the shivers every time I think about the settlement. I think we will grind there. 
we will grind in the settlement, but... I kind of don't want to go there. Does that make sense? Kaylee Steffens, thanks for being a member. Thank you for everything. Welcome to the stream. Hello, hello. Thank you for supporting the channel for such a long time. Thanks for everything. I think we might actually have now enough. Wood. Okay, we have 40 of that. That is good, ladies and gentlemen. That's what I'm talking about. Grind the settlement. No way. We will keep grinding it. But, like, every time I look at it, the amount of resources that we need to get there, like, there's nothing for me to grind. I need to get those square frames, and those square frames are gotten from... I mean, I'm already getting them. Like I said, there's nothing I can do. I cannot speed up that progress. I cannot build the second workbench to get more of those frames. There's only one workbench that gives those frames, and you can get five frames in, like, what, every, like, two hours or something? Every hour, every three hours? I don't know. Well, it takes a while. So, like, what am I gonna do? There's nothing for me to do. I need to wait until the workbench will... We'll build those frames anyways. So, I'm already grinding in the settlement kind of right now. There's nothing I can do about it. So, it's like, it's kind of weird for me to look at it. It's not like I can pre-fill the materials, right? I cannot pre-fill the materials with it. I need to have all of the materials in my hands. And I know that I don't have uh, those squares, so I can't do anything there. Once I get, like, 40 of them, maybe I'll start, like, upgrading something. Um, what do I need to upgrade this? Okay, we need uh, 20 steel. 20 steel, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for all the LDOE videos. You much appreciated smile. Kaylee, thanks once again for everything. Thank you for your support. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm glad that you're enjoying the videos. Huge thanks for the support. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. So yeah, to those that have just joined the stream, developers basically said that a new dog breed is coming to the game. Rottweilers are coming. Maybe we will check them out again. We'll check out that trailer if you haven't seen it yet. And uh, yeah, we need to upgrade one of the racks. And I don't know which one I want to upgrade. Do I want to upgrade this one? It's kind of almost full and... That's it. I'm going to upgrade this rack, ladies and gentlemen. Boom. Now we can store here 45 items and we have more space here. That is pretty decent. And, uh, yeah, if you haven't seen the Rottweiler trailer yet, to those that have just joined, I mean, I can quickly show it, right? We can quickly check it out again. It's like a 40-second trailer. A very sad trailer. I cried yesterday, as somebody said in the chat. <laughs> I cried all night in the pillow, couldn't fall asleep. So, there we go. Basically, there is the Rottweiler, and the Rottweiler died, right? The doggos got him. And boom, the drone saved the little Rottweiler pooch. This is so sad. Seriously. And here comes us with our credit card. Boom. We got the Rottweiler and we're going back home, ladies and gentlemen. We did it. <laughs> the credit card saved the day. <laughs> well, hopefully the Rottweiler will be able to find them. But yeah, it is what it is. Rottweilers. Very excited. I feel feels now. Yeah, guys, I feel feels now as well. I feel the feels. Is it just me or anyone else is disappointed about the transport hub loot? It was great when the update came out first and now it's just kind of mass scaling. Yeah, I agree. It became... At first, when it came out, it was worth it. Now, it's like... You can still clear it. You can still get loot. Like, I still guess that place could have been worse, but... The loot became... Kind of... Meh, as well. It was a lot better when it came out. Like, now it's just like, eh. I agree. I agree. I still don't think the loot is bad. I still think the loot is okay. But definitely, probably not worth anybody's time. Like, the amount of grind that you have to do for that transport hub, I don't know if it's worth it. I don't think it's worth it. You know what we could do, ladies and gentlemen? You might think, like, psych, what are we gonna do? We need to go get some wood. Because we are working on our base. So how about we keep doing that? How about we get some more wood? Kefir is allergic to OP loots. I don't really know why sometimes they nerf the loot. Like, why do you think... What, what is going to happen? Probably an average last hundred player can't grind Bunker Alpha properly, right? They still don't know how to grind it. So, why do they need to make things super hard? 
And it's not like they even like sell good things in the shop, right? It's not like they're they're good equipment packs. Like, look at this. The heavy equipment pack. 30 bucks. Like, are you kidding me? Like this thing. You can't even buy guaranteed guns. Like, there's only a chance to get them. Like, are you kidding me? So it's not like you can even buy things in the shop. So I don't know why the game has to be this hard. But hey, it's been like that since the release. It is what it is. Um, let's get some ghillie suits. Ladies and gentlemen. Let's equip my boots. Basically the most important part of the ghillie armor. Just so that we could run faster. My neighbors came over and I was like, eh, you gotta wait. I'm watching Cyric. Yikes. Uh, thank you, I guess. Hello, neighbors. Why are neighbors watching me? That's the point. There was a meme back in the days. When you tell neighbors that you watch Happy Psych, your neighbors will move away. Maybe you will no longer have neighbors. Mark my words, maybe they will leave now. That was like a meme from four years ago. Like, make sure to subscribe and tell me about... And tell me... Uh, tell about me to your neighbors. And then... The neighbors leave the next day. That was the meme. You still have neighbors? After telling them that you watch Happy Cyric? Unbelievable. I don't believe it. I don't believe my eyes. They will always hear that. Stop it! Yes, indeed. Yo, Zachary Castleman. You know what I'm gonna say. Yes, indeed. We gotta drink that water of shame. Thanks, Zachary. <laughs> Thanks for the super chat. This one, actually, water didn't feel like water of shame. Felt a bit better. I don't know if that's legal. That didn't feel like water of shame. It felt like water of, I don't know. Water of happiness? Try a last on earth randomizer. What on earth is a last on earth randomizer? Where do you get the bar? I don't know if you can get it now. I don't think bar is in the game. You cannot, you can no longer get it. Water of joy. Yes, Ness, bro. That felt like water of joy. Absolutely. That felt like water of joy. Not water of happiness, but water of joy. Zachary says water of shame. Yes, indeed. More water of shame, but this time it feels like water of joy. Are you sure that's water? That is water. That is water for sure. Hey, Sike, how are you? Uh, when's the next story-based game you're going to play? And when... Uh, was the next story-based game and when? I don't know yet. If I had a good story-based game, we would be playing it already. I so far don't have any. But I really want to play something. Really. Just waiting for something cool, I guess. <laughs> Name, last day on Earth, when, now. This is insane. Yes. I was thinking about Metro... Whatever it's called. Metro Redux or Metro 2033. One of those. But... I don't know. We'll see. Does I like, have another job besides YouTube? Like, how many jobs do I need to have? more jobs. I am a YouTuber. I am a NASA engineer. I am a doctor. I am a dentist. I am a professional athlete. Professional Rubik's Cuber. Professional GeoGuessr. Hell yeah. Since vibes, says Ness, bro. <laughs> you wouldn't believe what I finished out of the fishing. What I fished out of the fishing pond. I got a full durability hazmat shoes. Wow. Literally can't believe it. My mind is blown. K 
keep up the good work, man. I used to watch your videos when the game still only had Bunker Alpha. Thanks, man, for watching. And to be honest, the game still kind of only has Bunker Alpha. There were other locations added to the game, but... Yeah, still Bunker Alpha is in the center of it all. Cyric Magic Awakened just came out. Are you going to try it? I have no idea what that game is. Never heard of it. Never heard of it. I thought you hate chopping trees during a live stream. We're not chopping them for too long. I'm just getting two stacks of trees and that's it. I'm gonna get two stacks of ash trees. It's like I took your financial advice. What was my financial advice? I never gave any financial advice. It's like I took your financial advice and I invested all of my life saving into doggos in last day on earth. I'm like, okay. Instead of Do Dogecoin, I got doggos in last day on earth. Okay. That's a nice investment, I guess. That, would, that should be developer's next promo video or something. Why buy Dogecoin where you can buy last and earth doggos hmm if i was the develop if i was a developer i'd definitely do that if i was the last and earth dev i'd do it it's just genius it's simply genius how often does the big one spawn in the swamp i wanted to kill the big one in the swamp i've never killed him before in the swamp i wanted to do it but i think i spent like an hour searching for it and i never found it I just kind of give up on it. Gave up on it. I finally got True Friend Doggo. It took forever, but it's so worth it. Congrats on it. Congrats on the True Friend Doggo. It looks like Right Whalers are coming. So now we'll have to grind for the Right Whaler True Friend Doggo. Why not make the last Internet coin a crypto coin? Hmm. 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 Okay, how many, how much wood do we have? Whatever, I'll chop down a few more trees. As I said, I want to get only two stacks and that's it. I don't want anything else. I want my two stacks and then we can skedaddle back to the base. I don't want to spend here 84 years farming. It's been a while since I played this game. Any new stuff? It's been a while. Depends how long. For some people, it's a week. Some people were like, Hey, Psych, I took a break from last day and I'm finally back. And it's been just a three-day break. You know? So it just depends. How long was your break? Was it three days? Was it a week? A month? A year? In any case, even if it was a five-year break, nothing new. That's what I can say. Even if it was a five-year hiatus, there's nothing new. Bunker Alpha, that's what I can say. Okay, that's already two stacks of wood. That's enough. Have you played Dead by Daylight? I might have made a video on it. Maybe I played Dead by Daylight for mobile when it came out. I don't know. Like, I made one video on that game, probably. But, yeah. Okay, let's get all. There we go, we did it. Two and a half years uh, for me. I still need 30 car batteries for the ATV. Well, good luck with them. Uh, hopefully you'll get those batteries. Do you play Seven Days to Die? I've made a few videos on Seven Days to Die. A few live streams. Are you going to play The Walking Zombie 2? Yes, there will be more The Walking Zombie 2. I just don't know when. I just don't know the exact date. When there will be more The Walking Zombie 2. I took the longest last dinner break yesterday. It was two hours. Oof. 
Ooh, how did you survive? Two hours without last earner, that's crazy. That is legit crazy. I couldn't be able to do it. I wouldn't be able to do it. That's so brave, man. Very brave. Rot Wheeler. Excuse me? Today we're getting a new Rot Wheeler. <laughs> Rot Wheeler. Bro had withdraws and came in. And gave in, yes indeed. The dude caved in. And we are gonna cave in, ladies and gentlemen, because I have to wrap up this live stream. Got some things to do. So, also, I don't know if there will be a live stream in the next week. Uh, there will be some things that I need to do. So, that's why kind of I'm ending the stream today. Uh, because I got some things to do. And, uh, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, I'll maybe tell more when I'm back. And see you later. There will be videos, Nick. No worries. I'm still going to be here. I'm still going to be making videos. I just don't think I'll be able to do a live stream. But we'll see. We will see, ladies and gentlemen. Who knows? So take care, ladies and gentlemen. See you soon. See you tomorrow with another video. And uh, yeah, there will be scum videos. There will be last on earth videos. There will be a day R videos. And hopefully for fun reasons. Fun reasons, yes. Fun reasons. We. Oui. Yes, indeed. We, we, we. So take care, insane. And see you later, everybody. Take care and peace out, ladies and gents. See you later, everybody. Take care, take care. Have an amazing day, and see you later, peeps. Take care. Take care.